All right, we got problem number nine here. It says, which graph best represents a line perpendicular to line K? That means it's coming across it at 90 degrees. So here's line K. We have to figure out the slope of this. If you remember to find the perpendicular slope, two lines that are hidden perpendicular, if they're hidden perpendicular, the one guy's slope will be the opposite reciprocal of the others. It'll be a negated reciprocal. So let's figure out this guy's slope first, and we're simply going to take whatever its slope is, flip it, and negate it. So this guy, first of all, we know it's a positive slope because it's going up to the right. So this guy's got a positive slope. So our other guy, in order to hit this, is going to have to have a negative slope. It's going to have to be going the opposite way. And then we're simply going to flip the fraction of whatever this slope is here. So let's figure out the slope. The easiest way, here's a point, here's a point. So I'm going to do rise over run. It rises 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 runs one, two, three, four. Rise six, run four. Now that's better known as three over two when we simplify that fraction. So we notice it goes up one, two, three, one, two. One, two, three, one, two. So rise is three, runs two. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna find one of these guys that has a slope going the opposite way, so I need it to be negative, and we're simply gonna flip that. Two thirds. Since this guy's slope is three halves, we're going to flip it, the reciprocal, two thirds, and negate it so that it goes the opposite way. Since this is going positive, I got to hit it going the opposite direction. So all these are negative, so we know that. So I'm just looking for somebody that has a slope of two thirds. Let's just jump in here. I'm going to try this guy first. He rises one, two, three, four, runs one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So his slope is four sevenths. Nah, that doesn't simplify to the two thirds I need. That's not going to work. Let's go to this guy. One, two, three. One, two, three, four. So it rises three, shh, runs four. That's a slope of negative three fourths. We need negative two thirds. Not working. One, two, three, rises three, runs one, two, three, four, five. So that's negative three-fifths. Looks like it's going to be D, so let's see. Rises from this point, one, two, three, four. Runs one, two, three, four, five, six. So it's negative four, six, which notice is what we had originally wanted. That simplifies to negative two-thirds. Choice D for problem number nine.